everybody. I just want to tell you about a very special person who comes to our house. What, what day? When does he come exactly? December 1st. December 1st. This is Stevie. Stevie is our elf on the shelf. Is how he first appeared. And what he does, what does he do exactly, Katie? Tell us. Well, he comes to the house and starts watching us like... You know, it's a kind of secret. Nobody has known how Santa knows if we're good or bad. So, uh, um, the, Santa sends an elf, Stevie, to come to our house and watch us because we're kind of troublemakers. You're not that bad. You're a good <laughs> kitty. And so, what is he now? How does he go and get the information to Santa? Well, you cannot touch him or he will lose his powers. And he comes back and forth. You can give him a list because I gave him a list what I really want. He took it, and I'm guessing I'm going to get that for Christmas. You feel like he delivered the note to Santa? Yes, because when I woke up, he, he was in the same spot, and it was gone. Oh, very good. So, this is Stevie, the little elf. How did he get his name? Um, I really don't know. We just kind of made it up. We get to name our elf, so we named him Stevie. And um, he's a good elf, but look, his cheeks are kind of dirty and his nose is kind of dirty because the last couple years when he shows up, he uh, comes via the uh, chimney, so he gets a little dirty. But that is our elf on the shelf, and at night, he goes back to the North Pole, gives all the information to Santa on who's being good, who's being bad, what's going on here at the Ross house, and then you can find him anywhere. Sometimes he's naughty. Sometimes he gets in the trash. Sometimes he eats pie. Remember last year we oh, found yeah. him sitting in a pie. He's kind of hungry too. So that's our tradition right here, our elf on the shelf. But right now it looks like he's on a sled, so maybe he's in the mood to sled. Who knows? Who knows what he does when he gets back to the North Pole. So stick with us. And here's the secret. Do not touch him. What if, what if Bella touches him? It really doesn't count. I don't think the kitty counts. So anyway, Merry Christmas, and I'll keep you up to date on some more other some other traditions we do here at our house.